Hi, Mushan Gears here. In this tutorial, we will talk about Advanced Mouse Ring. So, here I am in Moho, and here is my character. I have masking in this layer to hide the teeth and the tongue when they are outside the lips. Let's activate the mask again. I will start by creating all the mouse poses on the same layer to make sure that they all share the same points so the morphing blend correctly between any pose. You can add as many morph poses as you want. Here I added some markers so I don't forget any pose and I started blending between uh, each letter. It's important to set all the mouse layers correctly. Even if the teeth or the tongue is not displaying in this pose, we still need to know its correct position because it will animate from this position to any morph pose. Make sure to use transform points tool, not the transform layer tool. Even if you will move the entire layer position, move it with transform points tool to blend correctly in the switch layer. Keep in mind that the upper teeth shouldn't be animated because it's fixed in the skull. After you finish posing the mouse shapes, now duplicate the mouth group with the amount of your poses and rename it. Group all the duplicated mouse groups and convert the group to switch layer. Now go to each group and choose a pose and copy it to the zero frame and delete the other poses. For example, in letter E, I deleted all the other poses and moved the pose keyframe to frame zero. Now if you try to use your switch layer, you will notice that it's not morphing between poses. To fix it, go to your switch layer settings and check on interpolate sublayers. Now your mouse shape will morph from pose to pose. You can fix or refine any pose on frame zero and it will update on the whole animation. Let's take this one step further. Create a boon to control his mood Add smart action. Oops. Smart action must have the same name to link the action to the bone. Here I added angle constraint. Remove the bone strength. The angle to the left should be the sad and the angle to the right should be the happy. Now we'll go through each pose and create a sad pose at frame 1, happy at frame 50, and the neutral should be at frame 25. That's it. Thank you for watching. If you found this useful, let us know in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe to get notified with our future tutorials. This is Motion Gears. Thank you.